With the help of Matt, Matt, um, who I must say has just been a tremendous help, he's helped me rebalance my system to start my big RM planer, which is really pulling hard. converter and uh, so we're balancing the voltages and amps at, at different locations um, and how we've done that is um, we've added more capacitors to the to the black and blue to the to the black and blue which is my single phase line and red to blue which is my single phase line and and, and capacitor cans just get wired between there so here you can see I have come up with um, this is a, a 75 a 50 and a, and a 25 um, and on the black side I've balanced out for a hard start uh, 250 so I have 250 from black to blue and I have 75 from red to blue feeding that uh, generated blue leg more power and balancing my system out for uh, the RM. So um, we'll show you what the voltages are now on that. So I'm going to start. And you can see I'm at 235 is the top voltage, that is my natural leg, and my red leg is now reading 253, and I'm at 258. Uh, you'll see that, you'll see that when I have the RM running, it'll really drop. Could maybe add a little more juice, but I think this is probably good. The idler is quite quiet, and uh, you know it's pretty good. Here it is with the PK running, which is a five horsepower machine. Here it is with the bandsaw running, which is a 5 horsepower machine. So I think the balancing is, is a lot better now, and uh, uh, thank you to Matt Matt, who got me the capacitors to add here. I calculated it, it's so close that all I'm left with is a 25. Uh, microfarads and uh, really easy to fine-tune your rotary phase to uh, run quieter and be balanced specifically to your machine where you wouldn't be able to do that with a store-bought one. So I thought that was worth sharing and a uh, shout out to Matt Matt for uh, helping me through this, finding the parts really inexpensive from China. Thank you, Matt. Matt, the system's running awesome. Bye.